Hi everyone, Luton here, and um, I'm giving you some more Vietnam content today. Now, I've been bringing up some Vietnam content this week because everybody seems to have been loving it. Um, I, I had a lot of questions, and so far I've only done live come round, so I thought I'd just cover a couple of things whilst showing you the quite spectacularly powerful PBR, or the patrol boat for the river. Um, the gunner position on the front here is mounted with two M2 Browning machine guns, and its power... It's pretty powerful. Um, it's pretty much one of the most powerful things you can have. It's so, so good. And uh, everybody wants to be on these front guns here. The only problem with this vehicle was that you become a little bit of a sniper hotspot. It's also very easy to take down. All the vehicles in uh, Bad Company 2 Vietnam are very weak. Um, a couple of RPGs and you're gone. Um, you can even take it down with machine gun fire as well, which is unlike obviously some of the other things. However, as I say, look at this, you can just mop it up. I've left in a bit of video footage after this section as well, so you can just you can just see the power of it, and we'll come back in at the end there. Um, so yeah, Vietnam. All the music as well, that's another question I've been asked regularly on the other two videos, was what is the music, the game music or what? Yeah, all the music in-game is, is, you know, that you're hearing on those other videos that I've made, it's in-game music. When you have the helicopters, it will play the Valkyries. Uh, when you're in the helicopters, when you're in the, the other vehicles, you'll get different types of music. Music. and in between the menus as well you get all sorts of, of different music from the from the period so it's really excellent um, as a game it, it functions fantastically this DLC there's a few weird little glitches like people notice the eyes on some of the snipers that's a weird glitch their eyes like pop out of their head <laughs> it's quite crazy um, but yeah so anyway today we're looking at the patrol boat and um, the only downside with the patrol boat is it, it can often have limited usage in terms of the map um, that's actually not a bad thing. They've they've designed it quite cleverly, but in certain areas of maps, you have to be very very careful because the patrol boats can really reap it up on you. Uh, on this map and uh, a couple of the other ones as well, it can really do some damage. But as I say, it's balanced up by the fact that the, the vehicle is actually very weak and it's often a bit of a sitting duck because it doesn't move very fast. Right, I'm going to leave you for a moment while we get in on uh, this other gameplay coming up in a sec, but I'll, I'll be coming back right at the end. Hi guys, back again, and um, so yeah, what we wanted to look at was right at the end here, and you'll see just how bad it can be when you get caught out by snipers in this round, this is the real thing. Um, so I hope you've enjoyed this, I'm really looking forward to bringing some more Vietnam content. Um, people have been saying that, that, you know, the servers are dead, they can't get it. Personally, from my experience, that's not the case, but I can totally imagine that it could be the case. You come on, there's no one on, you can't get anyone to join. I have been in that situation. But for the last week when we have tried to get in, it's not been a problem. You'd like it to be quiet for a minute and then more people will join. However, I think I'm going to discuss the whole topic of people joining other teams and stuff in a mo on another video. Thanks for watching. Hope you've enjoyed this one. More content always for me on the way.